My name is Ashwin and this is my first unboxing video. I bought a, a new telescope from Amazon. So what I bought is a Celestron 114EQ uh, with a German equatorial mount. So let's get started. Alright guys, so after unboxing, what do we have? So we've got a tripod, we've got two of the suspension knobs for the smooth transition and that's the balance rod, the counterweight rod, that's the counterweight, mm. it's pretty heavy, an IP tray, a 3x barlow, a Celestron 20mm erecting eyepiece and that's a 4mm that's how it looks it's plastic it's plastic that is also plastic uh, that's the finder scope holder that will go on to the to the tube that's the finder scope it's two of the clamps to hold the tube that's the the mount, the EQ mount. That's where you set your latitude. That's the right ascension. That's the declination. That's power seeker 114. That's 114 millimeters diameter of the primary mirror. So let's go ahead and do the assembly.
All right, so I've got the telescope out in my balcony. I'm going to use the street light as a target to get the finder scope and the eyepiece calibrated together. As you can see, you can't see the street light from the eyepiece right now, but after adjusting and moving the telescope, we can now see the street light over here in the eyepiece. Now let's look at the finder scope. You can't see it in the finder scope, right? So we're going to use the three uh, knobs or those three screws. Yep, these three screws and adjust to find the street light. Now it's all done. So whenever you see it from the finder scope, whatever you see from the finder scope is basically what you will be able to see in the eyepiece. So that's how you calibrate this thing. Great. Thank you. All right, after setting up the telescope, uh, I was able to find Jupiter. I'm using a mobile holder and a mobile phone. Uh, I'm recording the video, short footage of Jupiter with all four moons and Saturn after this one. It's, you'll see a lot of noise in the screen uh, because it's too dark and you can't actually you know, maximize or uh, magnify or zoom in to see the actual footage using a mobile phone at the moment but there are some few tricks and we can do that so i'll show that to you in the, the next upcoming videos so thanks for watching this video for now have a great day ahead bye